when should you let your teenage son or daughter share a room with their partner? Um, now, we, we ask this. We bring George it is making funny sounds. <laughs> <laughs> they know what they mean. Yeah. And I still like don't this. <laughs> <laughs> Now, obviously, you, you may have... Have you gone through this? The, the... His mum and I cut to the chase. Okay. We sent him to a co-educational boarding school and let him sort it all out himself. <laughs> Yeah, it's, uh, I, I, I don't, it was tricky coming back and that first time, I remember, you know, kind of creeping around with a girl and then, like, maybe trying to usher one out really early in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> and leaving one in. And... What age was that? Uh, Nine. No. <laughs> I don't know, probably like 15, 16, 15, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, I don't know, yeah, it's, it's a funny one. I remember the first time a girl stayed over at, uh, at Dad's house and my stepmum, um, she went, she went barmy, basically. <laughs> and I, yeah, and I just, I like, because the girl, I think the girl might have been a bit older and she was kind older of... Older than she, your she, stepmum. She was... <laughs> All about it all, and she was just kind of like milling around the house. And my stepmom was like, "Who is that? Why is she in our house?" And, all that? and I, was just, I didn't really know what to do because I was just like, "Oh, she's a friend. She's a friend." Yeah, so just a friend. Because I mean, well, Anne, you've yeah, got you've four sons. Yeah. Yeah. Good luck with that. Yeah. Good luck with that. And, uh, yeah, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we went through. I went through. You, you know, when your sons are grown up, when you realise that actually the, the little study bedrooms that they all had really, you should get rid of the desk now because they're not going to do any more studying, and, yeah. and maybe the, it should be a double bed. So all of the bedrooms now have double beds in them. <laughs> and I Green know, light, yes, ma'am. <laughs> Good idea. I tell you what I said to them all, though. I said, look, uh, you know, we're all grown-ups now. You are. And I know you've got serious girlfriends. And so, so if you want to, all right. But I don't want to hear anything. Quite right. <laughs> so you actually okay. said that, I did actually eh? say it. Yeah, cos I don't... You didn't say I, put the hand over the mouth no, like Gemma no. did. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, it was all very quick anyway. No, I, I, <laughs> I just wanted to say, I am your mum, yeah. you know, and uh, this isn't a hotel and it's not your flat. This yeah. is my place, so if you're going to come and stay the weekend or something, OK, but I don't want to hear anything. Oh, that's fair so enough. Do you, sort of, yeah. do you ever get wind of it, like, if you all had, to, <laughs> if you all had a meal? Is there a bit of a shifting around and suddenly they leave well, I, the room? I, also, yeah, I noticed over Christmas, cos it was very full house over Christmas, uh, lots of girlfriends and things, and, uh, yeah, we were all watching a movie and then suddenly I realised that two of them had gone. Yeah. Everybody slapped <laughs> off. Oh, I but they were good. I couldn't hear a thing. Did you turn up this around, Sam? Yeah, sound. you did listen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, you, we've... I mean, I, my son is, is 15, and um, I, I don't think he's quite there yet. I don't know. That's what but you think. I, OK. Yeah. <laughs> Think about, eh? Really? Right? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And also, we, well, our house is very tall. It's not a bungalow, so I don't know how we'd sneak people in and out. But yeah. we'd, I, I'd, la la la. <laughs> and, and at that point, the fingers well, you know in ears, la la la. What is so wrong with sex? Nothing. What is Nothing. that? <laughs> We just get hysterical about it, and then yeah. I think that forces our children out into places they shouldn't. I and mean, my parents said to me, "You know, have people to stay. We'd prefer you in the cold, in the warm, and the dry, yeah. rather than outside <laughs> in the freezing cold." Yeah, but there is an age of consent, isn't oh, yeah. there? Yeah. Which is sixteen. Yeah, no, yes. that's fair enough. Well, put, putting that to, so, to, to one side. Well, but can we put it to no, one side? No, no well, we're but... talking about. Well, no, OK. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but once you get to the age of consent, yes. I think people still get hysterical about their children having sex. And I just I just don't want to be hysterical around them. I mean, my children are going... When, if they say to me, uh, they get to the point where they say, I've got a boyfriend and I'd like them to come and stay, I would yeah. be totally fine with that. OK. Because I'd prefer them to be in our home, I'd prefer to know what's going on, than to be saying... George oh, no. to really but like also, you. I don't want them to think that sex is something that's... that's I mean, it's a, it's a great great part of life, is it not? No. Absolutely. Children. Oh, do you know we've run out of time? But could you, we come back and talk about this a little bit later? Oh, yeah. 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 Thank you. To, to, to... <laughs>